There you go. 7.38 in the morning. That's a look at your headlines. Here's Mike, who's laughing. All right, thank you, Sarah. That was a funny story. All right, here we go. Uh, Ty, you know, we hear about spring cleaning your house. How about spring cleaning your personal finances? Stuart Welch from the Welch Group joins us this morning to help us out with that. How are you doing this morning? Good morning. Great to see you. All right, let's start with uh, one tip you had. Contribute to your IRA early. Now, talk about that. So, uh, most people don't think about this, but if you contributed early in the year instead of late in the year, and I'm, I'm just going to use an example of $5,000 over 35 years. Okay you would end up with 135,000 more dollars in your portfolio wow. just by getting the money in early. All right, now the second tip you have is uh, dump the dead wood out of your portfolio. Now, this is one I've got to do right here. Well, so Mike, the market has been up uh, really strong last year, but actually strong over the last four years. So now's a really good time to look at your portfolio mm -hmm. and do rebalancing, look for stocks that look like dead on arrival, uh, and just do some cleaning up in your portfolio. A lot of times we'll find really small positions. You want to get those out. They won't help you on the upside or the downside. So they're not performing well in the last four years. You need to check them out and dump them. Absolutely. All right. Uh, check your 401k contributions. That's what something we can do regularly. Yeah, I think the main thing is, is make, first of all, make sure that you're investing enough in there to capture the company match. Right. And then the second thing is check the beneficiaries. Uh, typically, if you're married, it's your spouse. But look at the contingent beneficiary, because if your wife were to predecease you mm -hmm. and you don't have a contingent, it, that would be your estate, and that could be a problem. All right. Now, this is a very interesting, interesting one to me. Review your estate plan. This is so important, especially with power attorney as well. Well, and, and they just they just settled the estate tax law. The exemption amount, the tax-free amount is five million, and a lot of the old wills have a family trust that has a formula that says everything goes into the family trust that is not uh, that is going to be the exempt amount. And for a lot of people, that means 100 percent is going in family trust. That means that a spouse possibly might not get any money. So you need to double check that. And update the power of attorney. That's power of attorney you need to update every three to five years. All right, another tip you have here is review your insurance policies. Boy, yeah, we definitely need to do that. So I asked the question, if, if I were to die suddenly, do I have enough life insurance? Do I have enough disability income? If I had an extended nursing stay, do I have enough money to cover that? If, the, if you don't like that answer, get with your insurance agent and, and come up with some good solutions. And finally, uh, the last tip I really like, uh, you turn your spring cleaning into a money Maker. Now, how do you do that? Yeah, let's go in there and clean out our closets. And either if you want to do it the easy way, you can donate clothes to charity and get a tax deduction. Otherwise, do a garage sale. You can make money. And get your kids involved. Get your kids involved because uh, you can turn them into a young entrepreneur. You never know. Stuart Welsh, thank you so much. By the Thanks, way, Mike. in case you couldn't tell, he's taller than me. <laughs>